All Saints Wake is back for 2024, and this is another year you don't want to miss out on. This is going to be a quick but important video that's going to cover the event details and what rewards are in store. Real quick, if you like this type of content and haven't already, hit the like or subscribe button to help support the channel. With that out of the way, let's get right to it. This year's event will be running from October 18th, 2024 at 1am PDT to Monday, November 4th, 2024 at 6.59am PST. In case you're wondering what the difference between PDT and PST is, PDT or Pacific Daylight Time is a North American time zone in use from the second Sunday in March to the first Sunday in November during Daylight Savings Time. Pacific Standard Time is used during the remainder of the year. So to start this event, you'll have to be at least level 15, and you want to begin the quest the Aether Starved Ariman. You can start this quest in Old Gridania at 10.2 by 9.4 by speaking with a pumpkin-headed apparition. These quests typically take anywhere from 10 to 20-ish minutes and are quite simple. Now let's take a look at the event items you can obtain by participating. First up this year is the Knight of Devilry Glam Set. It's a 5-piece glam set and it's dyeable. The headpiece is a set of devilish horns, and the chest piece is a short sleeve button up with a colorful tie. I do hope that you can change the tie separate from the shirt color, which I'm almost positive it will be. The pants don't look to be anything too exciting, and the boots are very much a platform style Doc Martin boot. Overall, I think it's a nice set, and I'm most excited for the shirt personally. There is also a housing item for this event which is just called a Flying Pumpkin. Although there is no video preview, you can tell it will be a floating item. Worth noting for the housing item, you can pick up usually as many as you would like of these, and I recommend always grabbing some extras as you never know when you may need more. Also note that if you miss this event and want these items, they will more than likely be only available in the cash shop after this event during this time of the year typically. So that about covers this event guys. Let me know what you think about this year's prize in the comments if you have an opinion. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see y'all next time.